the time has finally come for this transmission to come out of Iron Man. If you wonder why I'm taking the transmission out of Iron Man, I'm going to give you a little clip right here. You ready? It's time to take it out. It's time to go get this transmission rebuilt, redone. We're gonna put a stall back in it this time. The shop is pretty much taken up from the El Camino and my daily driver. That's a whole nother video. I gotta get this thing pushed up to onto even ground and we gonna slide up under it, pull the dry shelf out and we're gonna drop the transmission out right here on the ground. Real shade tree mechanic stuff. But anyway, man, let me see if I can push this thing forward a little bit because I need to push it forward. The ground look a little bit more even right here, but it won't move, so I got to push it. We just finna see how strong your boy really is. God is everything. Without God, I'm nothing. And first thing we got to do is try to see if we can get this thing in neutral, all right? So we got the key. I ain't going to crank it up. Ain't no transmission fluid in it. Reverse neutral. Make sure now. Hold on. Alright. That should be neutral, y'all. We finna see. Ah. Slip. I gotta move it a little bit more from. And I'm tired, cause I just left the gym too. Yeah, just left the gym, y'all see it. Oh, it might not be working though. It might not be working. Cause I'm tired. Uh, come on, Iron Man, stop being so heavy now. Oh, boy. Ah! All right, I can't push it no more. So we're gonna have to stay. Oh Lord, it's a heavy truck. I don't know if y'all know that or not. It's heavy. Guys, no joke. This is how far I pushed it now. I know y'all can barely see the back when y'all was seeing the whole truck. But now, I had to go get some help. I got my wife out here. So I'm gonna push it and I'm gonna get her to throw the bridge back. I'm to... If you're into fitness and all that, you can go over to her YouTube channel, whatever. Nicole So Jazzy on Instagram and YouTube. And then I just tag her on Facebook. So go over there. Get y'all some fitness tips. Alright, this is the plan now. This is the plan. This is what we got. Alright, this is the plan. I'ma push it and then you go, I'm gonna give you this brick. When I push it, put it down in front of the tie to stop it from rolling back. Because it's kind of, you see, it's kind of an incline right here. So, that's really like right there where, you know, see how it look a little bit more even right there? I'm going to jack it up, put it on jack stand so I can go up under there and drop the transmission. Okay. All right. So, I'm going to roll it. I'm going to do like this a couple times. Like that. Hold on. Wait. I'm going to get it rolling. I'm going to get it rolling good. I'm going to get it up there pretty good. <laughs> All right. Go, 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 go. You ain't put it up under there enough. Oh. You got to get it 
right. I don't want to roll back none. Let's try from this side. You see, I got another brick over here. So I'm gonna push it from here, this side too. Same thing. Momentum, hold on. Go. Put it out. All right. This gonna take all day though. You know that, right? And you got on them Jesus sandals. Y'all see it, teamwork. I'm finna cut the camera off though, cause y'all ain't finna keep laughing at me. Iron Man is pushed forward, he's in position. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and jack it up. I'm gonna slide the drive shaft out. And to be honest with y'all, I, I let time got away from me, so it's gonna be tomorrow, but it's gonna be the same video for y'all. It's gonna be tomorrow, I'm gonna come back out here. We're gonna take the couple boats out, we're gonna drop transmission. But for now, I'm gonna go ahead and jack it up. Get it on jack stands. I got some good jack stands. Get it up on jack stands and pop the dry shelf out. That don't take but a minute. We'll drop that out. And uh, we'll come back in tomorrow, man, and get it in. And I know what you're thinking. Why would you drop a transmission out on the ground? Well, that's a good question. I'm gonna drop it out on the ground because number one, I gotta get it out. Number two, in the shop, two cars in there. The Honda, the whole front end broke off of it, broke down, ready for new CV axis and all that to go in. I got everything, but I still got to put that, that whole thing back together, press in, ball joints and everything, man. So maybe if I get that out, maybe I can get my cousin over here to help me push it, push Iron Man into the shop. Maybe we can put transmission back in, in the shop. But in this video, it's coming out, out here on the ground. I'm going to go get me a tarp, put the tarp out on the ground. We finna get it in. <laughs> Y'all stay tuned. Alright guys, I know the view ain't the best, but the dry shelf is out. The dry shelf is out. I don't know if y'all can see this or not, but it's out. As y'all can see, daylight is gone. It's gone. So tomorrow, man, we get up on the hill, we drop this transmission out, and we get ready to go to the uh, transmission shop. Y'all gotta stay tuned to see where it's going. But it's going somewhere cool. Y'all, y'all, you ain't gonna wanna miss the next one. You ain't gonna wanna miss it. It's going somewhere, it's coming back. That joke will probably go to second and go, Arr! Yeah, all that, stay tuned. I'm finna get up on the head and drop this transmission out here. Taking the transmission out ain't as hard as y'all may think it'll be. It's a few boats that go around the uh, engine, or you know, the bell, they call it the bell housing. There's a few boats that go across there. There's typically a few boats holding the torque converter to the uh, to the flywheel or flex plate, whatever you wanna call it. There's a few boats holding that, that to that. Um, Usually transmission lines, usually like two of them. Probably a few uh, other different cables and things that you'll have to take out, but it, it's, it's typically not a whole lot. So, uh, I'm not gonna show y'all how to do it in this video because I need to get this transmission out of here. I don't really have a whole lot of time. So, let me start getting this thing out of here. I'm gonna check in with y'all periodically, but y'all stay tuned. Probably kick down cable for certain transmissions, and then some some of your electronic transmission can't have plugs and things you might have to unplug. But it's just a plain giant OG. But uh now I got two bolts that I can get to from the bottom, but it'll be a lot easier for me to just get in the hood. That's a good thing about these C10s, man. You got a lot of space up on this hood. So we finna we finna take advantage of that. 
So what we doing, man, is reaching back here for the last two bell housing bolts. And I wish I knew where my 14 ratchet wrench is, but I don't know. I think I might have broke one of these loose at the bottom. I just couldn't, uh, I just couldn't get it out at the bottom because it was already loose. Either that, or I was riding dangerous. I know y'all heard the saying says stay dangerous, but not dang, that ain't mean nothing. Now we're gonna work on getting these two out, and then I'm gonna just check back in with y'all when it's time to drop the transmission down. We're gonna take a look at it. So y'all stay tuned for that. Wow. All right, man, this for y'all. That, oh Lord, this for y'all that the uh, transmission man charging too much, blah, blah, blah. Man, save you some money on some label, like me, and then take your own transmission out, man. This is, it, 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 I'm gonna tell y'all maybe how long it took me. I don't know for sure. Let me see. Let me check now. We're gonna check. We'll buy 11. All right, so I'm gonna guess it took me about 50 minutes to get everything done. That's with me trying to record and everything, man. So it was just it was definitely possible in 30 minutes. And I'm on the ground. If I was on concrete or I had a lift, way quicker. But man, all you need is a good ratchet. A good ratchet. Like, let me show y'all. This one came from Harbor Freight, man. As you can see, it tilts up and down. It's a replica of the snap-on one, man. This is gonna save your life every time. A bunch of different sockets, anywhere from an eight millimeter up to a 20 something. Not, not for this job specifically, but just for in general. Get you deep sockets and the short sockets. Get you wrenches, preferably ratchet wrenches. Ratchet wrenches don't always do the job, but I would probably have both. Ratchet wrenches and regular wrenches, some of them with the angles on them. And you could very easily do a job like this. When you get fancy, get your impact. It's gonna save you a few minutes. But uh, anyway, man, of course, jack stands, because I'm on the ground. And I showed y'all the jack stands a little earlier. So now's the time, man. We need to drop this transmission out of here. Uh, I got to get up on here, try to balance it so that it don't fall. But it's definitely doable without a transmission jack and all that. So let me get up on here, man. We're gonna try to get this thing out of here so we can get it to the transmission shop. Trans is out, as y'all can see. A uh, torque converter came down with it. Uh, let's see. Still got some transmission fluid in this thing, man. But we getting ready to go to the transmission shop, guys, and we gonna figure out what happened. I swear, I don't know what happened, y'all. So anyway, man. That's gonna pretty much end this one. Be sure to like, subscribe, man. Liking the video really helps this video get pushed out to the right people, man. And really helps my channel grow. So hit the like button. Uh, share it with somebody, man. Get my help and get my views up. We're gonna be bringing more content. We finna make this thing a beast after a while, man. So y'all just stay tuned, man. Stay tuned with me, hang in there with me. Keep subscribing, keep liking, man. I really appreciate it. Pulse TV, gone. Thanks for watching, man. If you show interest in supporting the channel, man, you can support us using the Cash App or the PayPal, man. We really appreciate anything, man. If you got something you want to send us, man, the address is down there up under the talk to us, man. If you got something you want to send us or email us right there at Pools TV, everything is there, man. Appreciate the support, man. Pools TV gone.